So how do you calculate numbers for a rental property? Hey, this is Brett Johnson with Realty Network Group at Realty Executives. And let's face it, real estate investments can be a great way to earn passive income, but you need to be careful. Not all rentals are the same, so you need to be able to identify which ones make sense financially. There are a lot of factors to consider, but the main way to determine if an investment will be a good one is if you run the numbers. The first thing you wanna do is figure out how much rental income, operating expenses, and mortgage payments are gonna be. The trickier part of this is determining your expenses. Of course, it's always possible for unexpected things to pop up, but here are a list of some common expenses. Accounting for vacancy, the fees of a property management company, if you want one, leasing fees, repairs, insurance, taxes, utilities, the list goes on. So this is where the math comes in. I recommend that you calculate your net operating income and cash flow. For the first equation, simply subtract your expenses from your rental income, and that's your net income. Then take the number and deduct your mortgage payment, and that leaves you your cash flow. If those two don't end in a positive number, you may want to consider another property as it may not be the right investment. Now this topic entails a lot of subjective and confusing things, so I recommend getting advice from an expert, and I would love to help you with that. Give me a call at 602-502-6468. I'd be happy to help you crunch the numbers uh, or discuss your situation in more detail, help you locate and secure an investment that would make sense. Thanks so much for watching.